Okay. Experienced recruits. We need instructor mastery level two and weaponsmithing level two to get experienced recruits. So we've got another Vestal here who could replace Jacob, I guess, who is now dead. Did we lose Ryan Endersby? No, we didn't. And Brettville. Did we lose Gaz? No, we didn't. Okay, so we'll get you in. We'll get you in and rename you to Stero Dude. Stero Dude. Stero Dude. Okay, perfect. And Bob has gone AWOL, I think. How do we tell where Bob has gone? Stress Eater and the Yips. Minus five accuracy. I feel like, um, fuck me, you just get so much of these negative quirks, like, and it's just so, so cumbersome to deal with them all, like, I guess some are worse than others, so you just leave them or whatever, but it just always feels bad no matter what, right? Like, I don't want any of my guys to have bad quirks, but I guess they're just gonna have them, you have to deal with it. Um, okay, I have, uh, I have 28 crests. I have 28 crests and not a lot of deeds or portraits or busts. Just wanted to say thanks for all the entertainment over the years. I have been watching since your Orcs Must Die one playthrough on YouTube. Oh, thanks. You make me laugh so much and make life so much better. Thanks. Here is 10 big ones. Thanks. Much love. Thanks, Fruity Fruitcake. I appreciate it. Thanks. Thanks for the 10 big ones. That's nice. That's nice. It makes up for that fucking gigantic mountain of bullshit that we just faced there. Fuck me. I can't upgrade shit. I need stuff. I need stuff and I don't really know how to get the stuff. I, I've got fucking crests coming out the wazoo. I don't want any more crests. Abominations? We don't even have any. What's this? 30% debuff skill chance and plus 30% debuff resist. I don't have any debuffers anymore, I don't think. Book of Rage. It's like I just read that one. 20% damage if HP is below 33% and plus 8% crit if HP is below 33%. We could go to the cove and get a speed stone or we could get this Book of Relaxation, which would be nice as well. I could really use that right now. Book of Relaxation seems really good actually. So this is a medium one where we have to complete 100% of the room battles, but for crests. We don't need more crests, right? What's this legendary bracer? Very rare. Plus 20% damage and minus 1% one speed, sorry, but plus 10% stress as well. Is that a good trade-off? 20% damage for less speed and more stress? I don't know. And then crests and busts. I guess we need busts. But this is just the reward, right? Like, we never know what you're actually going to pick up. So, how do you know what mission to do? Is it by trinkets? Do you always do a mission based on the best trinket? So, we would do, in this case, probably this one. This has got to be the best trinket, right? Book of Relaxation. With minus four dodge, though. It's really good. That one's very good. What about this one here? Uh, sorry, this one. No, this one. Sips. That fight was rough. But we all Legendary believe in bracer. you. You can do it. You are a 10 out of 10 dad. Can I do this? What Sonus is that monster profit? thing even? PFFT probs not even a 7 out of 10. I Greater know, than man. 3. That was just stupid, wasn't it? Okay, Epico can come along because he'll probably be pretty good. What skills does he have? Okay, that's alright. Epico's skills are pretty good. Uh, Molly the Witch, we could bring you along too. What skills do you have? You have Blight and stuff. It's fine. Uh, let's bring Gendermancer as a healer. Speaking of a gigantic Neandric? mountain of shit, my girlfriend Spook. ended up going to her mother's house because she couldn't learn to give me some goddamn space. She said she was going to her mom's house and was like, now that's impossible, sweetie, you can't go to hell. <laughs> my god, what the fuck? <laughs> Freddy Dog one thanks again. And Gendermancer, thanks again for the donation as well. I appreciate it. Um, so we give you this and, uh, you can have the, we don't have anything else that's decent here. I guess we could give you that blight and bleed resists. Who cares, right? Uh, you can have, um, wow, you could double up on these grave, oh, you can only have one of them. I see grave robber and scouting would be pretty good. Uh, 
what about you? You can have uh, plus 5% prot, I guess, and plus 20% move resist. It's pretty good. And you could have plus 10% stun skill chance and my plus 50% move skill chance. I don't even know if he has any move skills. We're, we're, we're about to find out. Okay, so we're going to try to fight this boss and get this legendary bracer. And uh, then try to get a leper. Apparently, it's very good to be used on a leper. Yeah? No? Minus one speed. What? Sips, if you lose spook, I will never forgive you. And I'm while well, trying not to lose spook is fucking awesome. I don't want... I do not want to lose spook. I really don't. Okay, let's provision some food, some torches. Uh, we got a shovel. Let's get another shovel. Let's grab some herbs, keys. Uh, let's get some la laudanum. A soothing tincture to in, in near one's mind against the horrors of the dark. What does that cure? What does that cure? I don't even know. Anti venom could be good. Bandages could be good. Okay. We're provisioned up to the up to the tits the now. Well Don't way. forget to equip the trinkets. I got them all. Oh, cures horror, right? Okay, so you can cure horror. I equipped all the trinkets that I could. We lost a lot of trinkets uh, when when we totally wiped there. Lost four dudes, four good dudes who will always be remembered forever and ever and ever as as good, brave dudes who went into a dungeon. And fought against just a just an avalanche of bullshit and were completely buried by it and died. That fight was the just stupid. I'm so angry about the whole thing. Feeling. I know I hide it very well, but still. You, you never use two full stacks of torches. Well, it's a medium one. And so, like, I'm thinking we have to find this boss as well. So, I would like to be all torched up as much as possible. Look. Even We've already used one of our shovels seems so early on passage. in the ruins. Don't worry, we'll get through these torches. It'll be fine. <sighs> God. Okay, we can get rid of some of these keys as well. Bone soldier. Okay. Nice. I'm just using it for the damage more than anything. Okay, these guys can take blight too. Oh my god. Fucking Molly the Witch. Whoa, Gendermancer. Not too sure about that one. Okay, but Epico, very good. A very sweet move you just did there. Real nice move. Okay, I think we can recover. I mean, it was bound to happen, right? We were bound to lose a couple of guys along the way. Yeah, I rage quit, but we were we managed to salvage it. At least I didn't move on to another game. I was very tempted to. Um, you know, there is at least that, right? Okay, Spook takes out another one. That's great. Nice. Okay, perfect. And we got our shovel back. So this is an heirloom chest. We didn't even need to use a key on that one. Got pretty lucky. Okay, good. So let's go to this room battle with treasure. Okay, we got another bandage back from that. A room battle with treasure. It's a lot of battles. Holy crap. Okay, we surprised all these things. They have no. This guy does have dodge though. Okay, Spook just killed two dudes. Another one falls. Molly the Witch, wow. This is the team, right? This expedition at least promises success. This is definitely the team here. This makes up for the other team that died. If you use a key, you just get more items. Right, okay. So we might want to get more items. Okay, good job, Spook. Nice, well done. Uh, do we want dazzling light? Torch plus six? Sure. Well struck. Torch plus six. I like that a lot. Okay, and then light on this guy. Yeah, nice. Three damage, and he's got four HP left. Oh! Missed! We're gonna pay for this dearly, chat.
We're gonna pay for this one dearly by taking a, a lot of muchos, muchos damagios. Eight. Dead. Perfect. Dead as well. Nice. Okay. Oh, Gendermancer. These heals. Okay, that's good too. For nine. I think uh I think Spook is my favorite. Honestly, Spook is just so fucking powerful, it's nuts. So this is already unlocked. So we got a, a move stone and some crests here. What can we get rid of? Okay, the move stone I don't really need. I already have one, right? I'm pretty sure I have one equipped right now, even. Okay. We'll keep moving. We'll keep going forward. I just do that. Move is great just for the damage, right? But I suppose she could just lunge forward and probably kill a guy straight up without damaging both of them. So I don't think those debuffs really do much for us. So anyway, she went to stay with her mother for a few days and while she was out, I noticed that my credit card had been stolen. So I thought about it, and never ended up reporting it considering the thief was spending far less than she ever was with it. <laughs> Fucking... Rowdy Dog One, thanks again for all of the donations. You're like on a donation spree today. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Do we want to pull this guy forward? Get rid of some of these corpses. Oh, it didn't actually get rid of the corpses. I thought that the pull got rid of them. Oh, yeah, spook. Okay, this guy is in perfect finishing uh, position now, too, right? For the boys. Or even just that. Works, too. Success. We don't have room for this picture frame. Doesn't matter. We've got lots of picture frames. The way is lit. The path is clear. Those are great. It's like a full torch, right? It's really nice. Um we don't need to camp just yet either, right? So we have to we have to find the prof. He's might, he might be over to the side here, but he's likely just to be up here, right? But we still have to go and check anyway. Might as well check and get more loot and stuff. Is that a sparkle coin? Oh, it has a map. Oh, okay, so we might be able to see. We might just be able to go the other way. Oh, it didn't show us the last rooms. God, that sucks. God, that sucks. Should we just lunge forward on this... On this fool? Yeah, we should, right? Kills it straight away. And then blight this guy up. Blight this guy up. Yeah, that's nice, actually. So that's three damage on the blight. Axe bleed. Okay, so that'll kill him next turn. And he's stunned, too. Perfect. And then we can just stun this asshole, too. Nice. Could disappear into the shadows. Chop this guy. And Spook could probably jump in for a... Do we need to heal anyone? Sure. We'll heal up Molly the Witch here. Okay, he's unstunned. And dead. Nice. A trifling victory. Okay, we got a, had a nice a nice trifling victory there. Real good. This dungeon is so dark. Should have gone straight. Yeah, we probably should have, right? So still worth checking anyway though. Who knows? We might find some good shit. Spook. I feel like it's just like spook can do no wrong at this point. It's insane. Oh shit. Might be able to stun him. Yeah, okay, good. Nice stun. Try to stun him to you. Oh, he resisted. What a slippery rascal. 
What a slippery fucking rascal. Holy shit. Can you please move your face cam so that it spooks face? No, I can't. It's too, it's really annoying to move the stuff around. Because it'll like, it'll break everything. Look, I, I went to all the trouble to put a little bar ben beneath me that says how many subs I have and how many subs we've had today. We've had 38 subs today. 38. It's amazing. Thank you very much, everybody who's subbing. The best. Okay, he's gonna die, so that's good. Um, we could do this. Spook is gonna come in like a wrecking ball, but won't need to now because he's dead. So Spook might come in like a wrecking ball on this fool, who's just gonna die anyway. Um, or we could just get rid of one of these corpses. Sure, whatever. We'll just get rid of the corpses. You can't get this guy at the back anyway. Let's try to stun him. Okay, good. He's stunned. So this guy dies. Yeah. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. Perfect. Twenty-five bucks Remind that I can't take. That overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Okay, we're getting another scout here. Okay, yeah, so we do have to go back this way. Good thing we didn't waste... What that scout was really good. We don't have to waste time going there now. We'll just go to the prophet and kill him. Holy crap. Um, what's this? What, is that... Gendermancer is, like, stressed to the gills here. We might have to set up a camp soon. The urn has nothing but ashes. If I use holy water on those ashes, does it do a thing? Oh my god. 120. Great, that is insane. What do you call a bunch of retarded kids in a pool? Vegetable soup. Oh ha ha. My Love you, god. man. Keep up the good work. Please don't. That is the worst. Vegetable soup. How could you? How dare you, Neil? <laughs> Thanks so much for the donation. Fuck me. If you press the refresh above the map, it places your people in the original positions. Oh, does oh does it? Default party order. Oh, so we're in default now. Oh, I didn't realize. I thought I had to do this. Okay, that's a that's a nice little feature actually. That's good. Okay, everybody's hungry, and there's a big pile of junk here in the way. But we have many shovels, so we're fine. We'll keep the torches lit. I don't want to fight hard monsters. I don't know about you. I know you guys probably fight them with like no, no fucking light whatsoever. But I'm I'm not that guy. Okay, I'm gonna camp in this next room too. What happens if I just burn all these books? I'll get stressed out, right? If I do it. Uh oh, I just got stressed out anyway, though. Maybe I should not have done that. Okay, I'm just gonna skip these books. Fuck it. Fuck the books. The books give you nothing but trouble. Curious is the, the capital T. Art, his efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. Okay, let's camp. Let's go for the feast. Nice. Okay, everybody is loving that. So we'll reduce the stress here. So we'll do um, roll morality debuffs. Pep talk. If religious, minus 20%. If religious, minus 15. So this is time cost 3. On one companion. Stand tall. Remain vigilant, friend. Self only. You're doing what about you? So long story short, because I really don't like to ramble, I took her to the train station personally when she left. Because you know, a real man always accompanies his girl to the train station when she leaves. How else to make sure she's actually gone? <laughs> Come on! Rowdy Dog One, thanks again. I appreciate it. The shield breaker dream is incoming. Oh shit. Yeah, we camped with the shield breaker. Is this a tough fight? The light, the 
promise of safety. Uh oh. A stressful past. The shield breaker is scarred from past trauma. She must navigate a series of seven flashback battles while camping. One battle per camp. Once those battles are completed, she can camp peacefully forever. The seven flashbacks are shared across the whole shield breaker class. You don't have to do seven battles for each shield breaker recruit. What the fuck? Monsters with stealth have a shadowy appearance and cannot be hit by direct attacks but are vulnerable to area of effect attacks. Mine got. And these snakes are guarding each other and stuff too. 24 fucking that's crazy. That's crazy. It fights back. I think these are going to be tough fights. Right before the boss as well. After I did all of that stress stuff. Okay, blight immunity is not like too bad. Do I have any any AoEs? No, not on this. Okay, resisted. Infuse. That's such a weird thing, isn't it? Okay, so let's heal you. But then we can do this, right? To get him out of stealth. Oh, it doesn't break the stealth. He's got one more round of stealth. Snake bites. Okay, maybe this isn't too bad. I mean, maybe I'm just like fucking... Maybe I'm amazed by the way that you love me all the time. Oh. Okay. Slink back to the shadows here. So then we can do like a... A real ripper of an attack. Oh god, the blight as well. Jesus Christ. Okay, we'll just keep rolling these heals. Keep our boys in good shape here. Okay, let's cure ourselves well. We could battle heal. Uh, or we could do this zealous accusation. Or we could just go in for the kill here. That's better. Okay, that's a dead snake. One snake down. Okay, and then let's try to fucking whack the shit out of this guy. Oh yeah, shit. With the defense, he defended. Let's see if we can blight him. Okay, he's he's blitten. Okay, got a crit there. That's good. Just keep whacking away at these guys. They don't hit that hard, luckily. That's not too bad. Can just about keep the boys up here. Oh shit. Do we have a thing? Oh, perfect. I'm a beautiful thing, they say. Flawless as the sea of dunes. Graceful as the desert wind. Captivating as a shimmering mirage. They stare, they linger, they watch me without blinking. Right, that's a beautiful thing, one out of seven. We got some... Some Aegis scale here. Mysterious scale from the distant waste. Fierce protection. Um, and we got a uh, venomous vial here as well. Plus 30% blight skill chance. Oh, that's great actually. So we can give that instead of this. Maybe take that home. That's a nice one actually. That's really good. Uh, let's take this torch. The citrine we can't take. We don't really want that. I guess we want this too, right? So like, I guess let's get rid of the... Let's just get rid of this move charm and this. And we'll take these both. Major scales are dropped by snakes who come from the shield breaker's homelands. These scales can be consumed by heroes to provide a single damage block of protection. The next attack that hits the hero will do zero damage. Oh, so they're consumables. Okay, that's kind of cool. And we're in, like, not bad shape here, considering as well after all that. Okay, so... We have to just make our way to the second boss's lair now. You can dumb your holy water and herbs. Oh yeah, I should have done that, right? Okay, let's disarm this trap. So, our shield breaker is like stressed right the hell out now. Too, because of that, uh, that episode with the snakes and stuff. Okay, let's torch up so that it's not too hard. As the light gains purchase, 
Spirits are lifted. And maximum torchage. So this is the second the boss. This is the sonorous prophet. His A true dingus. We have to get rid of some of these pews so that we can actually get back here and fight him. I usually just leave like a, a pew up. A momentary abatement. Because you can get behind him. I don't know if like killing all the pews sends him into like a rage or something like that. You know what I mean? No range. Oh my god! That that fucking damage was insane. Holy shit. Gotta roll them heels. Oh, is it because this is where... Does it always... Are these lines where the thing is gonna fall? So we wanna... Go forward. And have him tank some of that damage instead, right? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Eye on you. Oh my god. Oh, stunned as well. Okay. So these might miss. They did not miss. Fuck! That's so much damage. Why is this so much harder? I've done this before and it was not this hard. Okay, that's dead. Okay, so it's gonna fall on her. That's fine. Well, it's not. It's not ideal, but ah, uh, yeah, big crit. That's good to you. Perfect. Fulminate. Okay, so move him there. Jesus Christ. Rubble of Ruin. So we can finally start attacking him now. These guys are going to get fucked back here, though. Um, what does this do? Does this move me at all? No. Um, I guess we want to get the Blight up on him. If we can. Just keep stacking it up, too, right? Okay, well, I guess hopefully fucking she can dodge this. That would be really nice, right? Um, we're gonna have to try to heal past this, too, as much as we can. It's rubble of ruin. Fulminate as well. Everybody dodge that. It's great. Um, can we, like, debuff him or anything? Can we stun him? His stun resist is 100. It's not great. Whoa! Oh, come on! Dodge one of them at least, for fuck's sake. No, not even a single dodge? Seriously? Three in a row have hit me. Like, what the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna keep blighting the shit out of him, too. So we have to cheat death here as much as we can. I think we're just going to be low no matter what. Rubble of Ruin is going to fall at the back on what's-his-face. So we just have to keep going for it here. Okay. Another no dodge. Scales. Oh yeah, scales would be good, right? It's gonna fall on her. She might she has a decent chance of dodging it though, right? Oh yeah, scales would just about do it. I think we're gonna get him though. Six damage. Okay, let's see. Uh, finally a dodge. If anybody's got a good chance of dodging, it's Spook, right? Oh yeah, with the death blow too. Okay. Oh man, it was pretty ropey, but we got there in the end. 
Um, what's this? A Crusader's Seal Protection Stone. And these are worth 2,500 gold each. That's great. Okay, so let's grab these things so that we're rich beyond our wildest dreams. Do we want a Protection Stone? Plus 5% protection, one speed. I mean, I guess we could just take it and sell it, right? I don't know what to get rid of the keys, I guess. Sure. Oh, God, that was close, boys. Holy crap. Swap for torches. Yeah, I should have swapped for torches. You get a little bit of money back. So we got this legendary bracer now. 20% damage. It's a pretty good one, right? It's not bad. What did we get here? We got 20 crests, which we... God damn, and we got eight busts, no deeds or paintings. But look at all the money that we got. Holy crap, that's insane. Okay, and that's another boss down now, too. Spooks Resolve is now thick blooded, plus 10% blight resist. Okay, that's nice. That's really good. Hey, Lamb and Todd, thanks so much for all the gift subs. Thanks. Go to the Weedled for Deeds. So we have to do the necromancer next. So the apprentice necromancer is who we killed, but now we got to go for the actual, the real deal. The full dude. Okay, gendermancer, you can do some drinking. Molly the witch, you can go do some gambling. You guys have just, you've, you've earned your rest. We've earned your rest now, you can go for it. Okay, let's see who we have here. Another hellion, aha, we got a leper. It's Talvase. It's Talvais. Do we want a Houndmaster? We don't have one yet. All one and the same. Mortang, the Hellion. Did we lose a Hellion? I think we did actually. So we need to get another Hellion in as well. Barbaric rage and unrelenting Stage coach. A number of available heroes to four, and our roster size twenty one. So we need some deeds for this. Um. Or do we want to start concentrating on getting... What was it that we needed for experienced recruits? Structure mastery and weaponsmithing to level 2. So what's weaponsmithing at now? Weaponsmithing is not at level 2. We need deeds. We could trade some of these crests for deeds, I guess. Fifteen crests for... Oh my god, this is not very good. It's not a very good trade, is it? So we need to go to the wield. And what was it? Instructor training as well? Instructor mastery. So we need some paintings as well for crests. We need 38 crests though. So we need some paintings and deeds. I don't think we should be trading for that many, right? It's going to be like too much. Epico. Epico is good, man. Epico is really good. Bob's and Stero, dude. Oh, yeah. And then we've got... Uh, who's this going to be? Barum. Barum. And who else wanted uh, wanted a person? Was it Liz That's Me or something? Oh, yeah, it was you. It was Liz. Liz. Liz That's Me. We'll just call you Liz, okay? So it's probably easier to, like, remember and stuff, too. Okay, what abilities do you have? If it bleeds. Uh, breakthrough, which works on the front three. That's pretty good breakthrough, actually, right? And Wicked Hack. Adrenaline Rush, Iron Swan, Barbaric Yop, minus 20% damage and minus 3 speed on self. Bleed out. Okay, we'll try you like this. That's fine. Okay, so we want to um, unequip all of my trinkets so we can reapply them to the new to the new boys. Should we take Barum out to the ruins? On a medium one to gather some holy relics and get a hound master thing. Oh, yeah, we got Mendeville here, too. Who wants to be a hound master? Who likes dogs? La Lama Todd. Lama Todd, you got it. You're the dog master, okay? I put you in against your wishes. Spook. And. Okay, so we'll, we'll take Barum out. We'll take Liz out. On this one, this is a medium apprentice one, right? So we'll we'll let them skill up a little bit and see how they do. Uh, we'll take Stero Dude out on this one as well, and then we'll also take um, Gaz. Gaz could come out and help the boys, or or should Gaz help the boys? Who's good for helping the boys here? Dowie could maybe help the boys. What about Out of Keck? 
Why do Keck hasn't really been used much? Probably benefits from being in this position. And then Stero Dude as well, who has Divine Grace, Illumination, Hand of Light, and Dazzling Light. I think that's fine, actually. What do you have? Aimed Shot, three at the back. Buckshot, but you have to be at the back. But you're at the back, that's fine. Sidearm and Skeet Shot. Okay, good. All right, trinkets-wise, um, for you... You can bring um, this and this. That's fine. Uh, you can have these uh, musketeer boots and what? Like um, prot survival guide. Okay, musketeer will have the survival guide. Hellion can have the double-edged pendant for max HP and stun resist. That's pretty good. And then you can also have fucking this protective thing. And then we'll put onto you... Baron, please don't die. A legendary bracer, okay? And also a protective stone as well, okay? Please try not to die, though, Baron. I'll be so mad if, if you do. Okay, and then we're going to get a cudgel for our Houndmaster from here as well. Should be, like, a, an easy one, okay? Good. Okay, so let's take some food. Let's take some torches. Uh, we'll take some bandages, some of this You're stuff right here. Now. We'll bring our scales. Should we you bring You forgot about me, boss. Sure. I'm very sad. Oh, Penny, I'm so sorry. We'll get you next time, okay? I promise. Um, uh, should I bring... We got the illumination stuff with, uh, Stair Dude. So maybe we don't need as many torches. Maybe we can go, like, on a shoestring. I guess we need some shovels, though, right? It's a medium one, so we're gonna be doing a camp. So we got all the food. Um, uh, let's just grab, like, maybe four torches, okay? We'll do it like this. Yes. Good. False promises. Leper is a ruins phobe, really? So he gets plus 20% stress in the ruins. Okay, well... And so he's gonna get 30% stress in the ruins. So maybe... Maybe, yeah, maybe we don't bring Barim on this one. That's, cl that's a close one. We almost embarked there. We almost embarked. Okay, so we're not going to bring Barum on this one. We're instead going to bring um, Epico. Epico is going to is going to come and take care of the boys on this one, right? Because who else can can realistically tank this? I guess the Hellion can. Alsa Salim can't really. What about Ryan Endersby? Ryan Endersby could probably do it, right? He's got a weak grip, weak grip on life. Okay, where are you now, Barum? Okay. So Ryan Endersby, you can have stun skill move chance. You can have this. It's fine. You're not a you're not afraid of the ruins, are you? We'll get you doing like some protections and stuff. Okay. So back to pro oh, fuck. Back to provision. Let's get some shovels, some torches. Um, some bandages, some of this stuff, some of this stuff, and what, some holy water? Maybe just one, just in case. And then we'll take some anti-venoms. Do we need anti-venoms? Yeah, okay, we'll take some as well, just in case. Scales. Bring the Crusader. Oh yeah, in the ruins, Crusader would have been good, right? I just don't want Epico to, like, get to level 3 and then not be able to go out with the boys, you know? Because he might, that might happen. We have to gather three holy relics. Okay, let's see if we can find them. Does anybody got this? Have the scouting map thing? I can't remember. Oh my god. Curious is the trap maker's art. His efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. Okay, we're off to a great start here. Somebody's fallen into a trap, and we've got a room fight. Everybody's crying and shitting their pants and stuff. It's awful. Okay, what about this breakthrough, though? This will move us forward one. Oh. Alcalahora. I like that. Okay, retribution. Let's go for it. Then we can put a guard up on the on the Hellion as well. Dazzling light. Confidence Seems good. As the enemy okay, and then aimed shot. This is Buckshot, which does knockback. Yeah, nice. That knockback is great, actually. Holy shit. 
Okay, and then Ryan Endersby hits him back. And misses. Sure. Oh yeah, she's taken a lot of damage from that trap, so we're gonna have to get her. Is she a Ruins Phobe as well? I should have probably checked first, right? Sidearm, and then the Skeet Shot. Bypasses Stealth, but gives us Torch plus three. Hits everybody. Do okay, but does no damage. That's fine though. Okay, so we'll let's guard you since you're low on health and they like to target you for whatever reason. If it bleeds. Oh fuck! I hit the wrong guy. I forgot that those guys are 200%. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Oof! Big crit. Oh my god, that guard is so good. Hey dad. Hey. I'm in dire need of your help. I can't decide what to eat for lunch. Should I go buy a big old greasy pad thai which is what my heart desires? Yeah. Or should I just chew on some dry pasta from my cupboard? Love. Long live the communist gamer revolt. <laughs> Elias Teteris. Um, go for a pad, a pad thai. Go for a big old greasy pad. I would. I, I definitely would. I mean that it's unlocked already. Okay. We don't need to use a key. Let's just open it up and see what's inside. 350 bucks straight up. Nice. Thanks so much for the donation, man. I appreciate it. Okay, we're off to a strong start here, I, f I feel. I feel like this is good. Take this money and run. Shit, another trap. How come we're not seeing any of these traps? We don't have any good trap perception or something? Is that the problem? Did we get a squat yesterday? No. No, because we didn't hit fucking 300 subs in one day, did we? So no, there wasn't a squat, funnily enough. There's rules. There's rules and regulations. Skeet shot, buckshot, the knockback. This does marked. Sidearm gives myself three speed as well. A devastating blow. Oh, I clicked on the wrong dude. That's annoying. Breakthrough. How come I can't use breakthrough here? Oh, because I'm not in the right position. If it bleeds. This guy can bleed. No, these guys can't. None of these guys. All of these guys are ultra bleed resistant. Okay. I like that his skills add to torch. That's awesome. It's, it's such a cool thing, isn't it? Okay, let's actually just kill this guy. Do retribution here. Uh, so Buckshot will do the knockback. I thought knockback... I thought, like, this when you moved stuff through, it, like, got rid of the thing, but I guess not. It's kind of annoying. Um, okay, we'll kill him. Destroy them all. Oh, nice. Big crit. That's a beauty. Um, okay, we'll guard her again. Since they seem to like to pick on her. Nice. Nice. Every time she gets targeted, it's kind of nuts. Uh, if it bleeds, could... Oh, yeah, no. It's not going to work on any of these dudes at all. So we just have to get rid of some of these corpses to bring these guys forward a little bit. Aimed shot. Nice. Okay, I'm starting to like the Musketeer a little bit, actually. Stun chance resist is not great, but still resisted anyway. Um, and crush. He's in crush range, at least, so that's good. Oh, and stun, too. Nice. Can I turn up the game sound? I love the voice actor and can't hear him loud enough. Is it not loud enough? Success so clearly in view. Audio? Or is it merely a trick of the light? Is that better? A bit lower? It's very loud. It's way too loud. Yeah. How about that? How about 15? Save, yeah. 
15 should be fine, right? Is that better? 25! This is perfect. Okay, good. You like it a little bit loud? Um, so we need... Holy... Okay, this is a quest location. So we'll head down here to this quest location. A real gamer would have it at 100. Well, I'm not a real gamer, obviously. And some reward. Okay, I'm just going to skip well the whole case. I've learned my lesson. I don't want to get stressed out reading books. Oh, what's this thing? Can you please turn down the voice acting? It drives me crazy. <laughs> it's like, you know what? I liked it before, actually. It's too loud for me now. I don't like I don't want it this loud. That's perfect for me. I'm I'm keeping it down. Um okay, let's do retribution on this fool. And then we'll do the guard as well. And then we can do this breakthrough here. Um and then we can do this knockback on these guys too. Oh, one of them resisted. Nice. Wrong target, bitch. Oh, look out. That's the one. Holy shit. The value. He got four fucking attacks off. That's crazy. He's stunned now, though. Unfortunately. So now that he's stunned, he can't fight back. That's annoying. Oh my god, this combo! So good! Okay, we'll kill this guy. And then let's fucking shoot these guys at the back. Yeah. The old Muscatoni. We couldn't get the uh, defend up though, sadly. You think it was five before? Is it still a little bit loud? Is that better? Yeah, it still sounded a little bit loud, right? That doesn't do that much damage. No. Why not turn the music down? Instead of the whole game. Um, because I don't want the sounds and stuff to be too loud either. Funnily enough. I just want the whole thing turned down. So that I can, I can hear myself speaking while I have headphones on. Because I, I love to listen to myself speaking. God, these corpses are real pro. Oh, there we go. There we fucking go. Prize is mine. Out of Keck. Out of Keck is doing it. Oh, this is the quest room. That's why. Um, so what do we want to use here? Torches? Fuck, we have so many crests, though. It's crazy, right? So we have to make space for this stuff. These things, too. We have three of them to collect. That's nuts. So we're not going to be going back with many riches and spoils, unfortunately. We're going to have to get rid of a lot of them. So this one is locked. So we have to use a key on that one. That's a lot of money. Fuck me, that's a lot of money. Jesus. What can we get rid of? Anti-venoms. Okay. Oh, shit. Ancient traps. So many traps. Chad is like going on a road trip with a thousand kids in the back seat. I know, I just, I mostly ignore the back seating though, so don't worry. Occasionally I, I ask for advice, but it doesn't, it doesn't always happen. Uh, battle room, we could probably skip the battle room. Unless we want to go for it. Ah, fuck it. Let's just skip the battle room. We don't need to fight every everything down here, right? We just want to fight the stuff that we need to fight. So this is not a quest room either, I don't think. Battle. Oh, yeah. We've been there already. That's why. Okay. So we'll go this way. Maybe we'll get another quest item. We need three of these holy relics. I'll just skip this bookcase. Too. Oh. 
Can we go to Dairy Queen? Are we there yet? <laughs> are we there yet? Are we there yet, Dad? Are we there yet, Dad? Dad? My kids aren't like that. They're not like that at all. My kids are like uh, really chill. I'm lucky. I'm really lucky that my kids are the way they are. We have no way of marking these guys, right? Clear stun and clear mark targets on our heroes. Torch three. Bypasses stealth. Buckshot. The ground quakes. The buckshot man. Okay, let's try to get rid of this asshole here first. So if he's marked, does that mean that these guys are just going to um, attack him no matter what? Oh no, not necessarily. Okay. Or if they can, they will attack him. Is that how it works? So like forces them to attack. Some attacks combo with a mark. Right. can crush this guy but we missed okay so we're not marked anymore so now he can just attack whoever is that how it works okay. good do we want to camp here I think we probably do, right? Start getting rid of some of this food and stuff. This is a quest location. Yeah, I think we can camp here. It's fine, right? Huddled together. We'll go for the ultimate feast as well and start doing some de-stressing. Weapons practice. What is it? Pep talk. Four, bat four battles. But plus 10% crit for four battles. Pep talk. One companion, pray. Sanctuary. What do you have? Encourage. Okay, that's nice. Clean the musket for four battles. Or do some triage. Okay, we did some triage. We don't have a shield breaker with us, right? All companions, plus 10% damage for the next four battles. Yeah, let's do that. And then let's do plus 10% crit. Plus 25% damage if in position 1 for 4 battles. Minus 15 stress. Okay, that's all we can do. Okay, we don't want to have any nightmares tonight. The way is lit. The path okay, is good. clear. We no nightmares it was. The strength to follow it. Okay, so we have... Oof, that was close. I almost ran right over it. 70%. Okay, good job, Atakek. Nice disarm. Nice de-stress as well. Proud of you. That's great. Houndmaster has such sweet camp skills. Really? Okay, that's the second relic. So now we're just making our way through the rest of the dungeon to get to the third relic. And then this new team of dudes. Oh, here it is. This new team of dudes is, is done. Their first mission successfully. Yeah, let's just return. The abbot will be grateful. The trappings of his faith have been restored. That's great. We made a lot of money. We got a bunch of busts and crests Daughter as well. Daughter is sick today, so the day off work. Yahoo made her a nice curry for lunch and she eats just a bite and says she is full. Feels Evasive. bad. Any bets today at Balance? Cheltenham? Dud hitter. Any bets today at Cheltenham? No, sorry Neil, none. Thanks so much for the donation, man. I appreciate it. And um, have fun with your day off uh, where you made her a nice curry for lunch. And she just eats a bite and says she's full. Feels bad. Well, that's the thing. you got to make a nice curry that you yourself would like to eat. And then you give it to her and you say, here's your lunch. And then they eat one bite of it. And you're like, oh, that, what a shame. You're full? Want me to eat it? And they're like, 
yeah, that'd be great. And you're like, okay. And then you eat curry for lunch. Yeah, no, kids don't like curry. You should have just given her like a chocolate bar for lunch. That's I think that's what kids ideally would like to eat. Enjoy your day, man. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. You're eating it now. Good. Good. The Abbey will be decorated for the duration of the event, and all are welcome to visit during the extended hours. The cloister, the transept, and the penance hall all free. Motherfuck. That's great. That is just great. Okay, is everybody back from active duty? And I like this. I like when they put the candles and stuff. It's real nice. Nice little touch, isn't it? It's good. An otherwise very infuriating game, but it's good that they... It calmed down the fury a little bit, you know, sometimes. So we have a Crusader, another Plague Doctor, another Hound Master available to us here if we want to use them. Um, we also uh, need portraits and deeds, which we didn't need. We didn't get any. Ugh, pardon me. We didn't get any on that last mission. I think we need to start going to a new place, potentially, to get some more of these things. Because it's like busts and crests from the ruins. Is that about right? Check out this game called Rise of Industry. It's a modern TTD city builder. Yeah, I played it. It's all right. I mean, what you poke the hardest boss in the game so casually, of course, it's going to bite back. That, is that the hardest boss in the game? Because I've beaten him before, like, like with dudes that were like level two and stuff. Did I just luck out or what? Like, he's the hardest. So there's nobody harder than him. That's kind of crazy, right? You just got to make sure you kill those tentacles. It's one of the hardest until the darkest dungeon. Right, okay. I didn't realize that that was the case. That's crazy. Ancestors' time, memoirs. You will know the tragic extent of Does my this failings. thing, like, look better the more memoirs you cover? Part 1. Defeat the Brigand 8-pounder. Where's, where's the Brigand 8-pounder? Where are all these dudes? Mastery over life and death and the wandering pro. Oh, I see. So we've done these guys already. So you unlock these and the darkest dungeon and the epilogue and the collected journals. A beautiful thing, a trampled journal. Blood soaked pages torn from a journal. Do these things all like unlock stuff and then make that look better? You just fight variants of the same bosses. All oh, right, okay. All right, so we need to um, go to our trinkets and unequip them all. And then we need to embark. So ruins, we got up to level three now. So will we always get apprentice level one missions from the ruins regardless of the boss progress? Oh, it's boss progress. Oh, so we're getting some of these level three ones now because House of Salim is three, right? but we wouldn't have gotten them otherwise. The journals don't give you anything. It's just lore. When Mario Maker 2 is out, will you be inviting Lewis to Jersey so he can play the levels you and your son are going to make? It's funny the first time. Yeah, we can do that. It'd be pretty fun. He's due to come over like this summer anyway, I think. So it's been a little while since he was last over. Last time he was here, I think it was like two years ago, possibly. He didn't come out last summer, but he came out the summer before, I think. So yeah. So he, he, yeah, we could do that. We'll, we'll try to do it. We'll see if we can get him out. I think Hat Films might be coming out um, this summer as well, at some point, potentially. So the journals don't give you anything. Yeah, I know. So there's nothing worth it. It's not worth collecting them at all. It's just if you like the story and the lore, that's the only time it's worth doing it. Okay. Uh, so this one gives us a, an occultist. Um, Thing, but we don't even have an occultist anymore, I don't think. And one hasn't turned up for a while either. Um, we could do this one for... Wait, it's the same thing. There's a Bounty Hunter Agility Talon, which is pretty good. Plus one speed and plus four dodge. It's not bad. Uh, there's a plus 20% max HP life crystal here, which is pretty nice. And there is a Lock of Patience for the Abomination, which, of course, we don't have an Abomination. Uh, this is going to give us portraits, which we need, and this will give us deeds, which we need. Uh, I think we need deeds more than anything, right? Who do we want to take? This is uh, Explore 90 Runes. So Warren's Baron would be fine to go to the Warrens, right? So we could take him, take Ryan Ender's B again. Uh, let's take uh, out a Keck again, because that worked out pretty good. And what, Stero Dude again? 
and we'll go to the we'll scout the warrens a bit try to unlock a boss clear path to the boss we're, we're currently working on it and get some deeds all right gotcha 